Namaskar and Salam. In today's video, we will take the Seen group. The group has only two letters, Seen and Sheen. The Hindi sounds and letters representing Seen and Sheen are Sir and Sh. Both Hindi Sh letters are written in Urdu with Sheen. The shape of both letters is pretty much the same except Seen does not have the nuktas, the dots on top, and Sheen has three nuktas on top. Just like majority of the other Urdu letters, they also have four different forms. Detached, initial, medial and the final forms. Here in this table, we have given these forms only with seen, but both seen and sheen behave the same. The only difference is the nuktas, the dots. And only this part of the letter and the nuktas are used when it comes in initial and the medial form. The detached and the final form are more or less the same, except the final form is attached to the previous letter. Let's take the different forms of the letter seen. The detached form is the one as in the alphabet sheet. The initial form is this. It looks like the first part of the letter. The middle form looks like the initial form just connected to the previous letter on top. And the final form is similar to the detached one, but attached to the previous letter on top. The green circle in this picture shows where the previous letter will be connected with seen, and the red circle shows where the following letter will be connected. Let's now take some words. The first word is Ras, meaning juice. The spelling is Re plus seen. Here the shape of seen is detached because the previous letter is Re, which is non-connector. So you simply write re for r sound and seen for sir sound. So re seen, r sir, ras. In the next word, the letter seen comes in the beginning and connects to the next letter. The word is sir, meaning head. The spelling is seen plus re. The first letter is seen, so you write the initial form of the letter and connect it to re. So seen plus re, sir, r, sir. You can see that seen has only the first part of the letter because it will be connected to the next one. The next word is kasar, that means defect. The spelling is kaf plus seen plus re. Here seen comes as the medial letter. It is connected to the letter kaf, the ka sound before, and to the letter re after. So you write the initial form of kaf, ka, then the medial form of seen, sa sound, and then final form of the re, the r sound. So K, S, R, K, S, R. The first letter kaf is in its initial position. You can ignore it for now because we haven't learnt it yet. But pay attention to the seen in the middle position. It is connected to kaf in front and then to re on its back position. Just like the previous word sir. The spelling is kaf plus seen plus re. K plus S, plus R, K, S, R, K, S, R. The last word is bus, meaning enough. The spelling is be plus seen. Here the letter seen comes at the end, so it will take the final form. Seen at the end of a word is written similar to the detached form. It is just connected to the previous one. So the spelling is be plus seen, b, s, bus. The be will take initial form and seen will take the form, final form, b, s, bus. And then here are all the words we have taken in this video. The first one is Ras, where seen is detached. The second word is Sir, where seen comes as initial letter. The third word is Kasar, here seen is in between two letters and takes the medial form. And the last word is Bus, where the letter seen takes the final form because it is the last letter of the word. In our next video, we will take the Swad group. The Swad group has two letters, Swad and Zwad. Their counterpart Hindi sounds are S and Z. See you there. Namaskar and Salam.